let's talk about finding the determinant of a matrix. The determinant is this like special number um, that goes along with a matrix. Like for this matrix, where if we find the determinant, then that's a number that we'll we'll talk about how to use a little bit later on in a different video. But to actually find it, what you do is you take the diagonals of your matrix and you subtract them. So I would take my diagonal of 3, negative 5, and I multiply that together. Then I subtract by if I take the other diagonal and multiply it together. So that gives me 2, comma, negative 4. So this would give me negative 15. Negative 2 times negative 4 gives me plus 8. Negative 15 plus 8 is negative 7. So this is our, our special number called the determinant of this matrix. That's really easy if we have a 2 by 2 matrix. It gets quite a bit more complicated if we have a 3 by 3 matrix like this one. So also this uh, these lines here, if they give us a matrix and these are lines instead of brackets, that means they want us to find the determinant of the matrix. So that's just kind of a notation thing. So what we're going to do is start off by rewriting the first two columns of this matrix. Because we're going to look at our diagonals, and if we don't have these out here, it's going to be harder to see what our diagonals are. So I'm still going to look at my diagonals and subtract them, but this time I have a lot more diagonals. Like I have this diagonal here which is 2, 3, 8. And I also have this diagonal here, which is 1, 5, 4. And then I have one more diagonal going this direction, which is 0, negative 2, negative 6. Okay, so for this set of diagonals, I'm going to add them together. And this is going to be the number for my diagonals. And then I'm going to subtract what I get if I do that the other direction. Okay, so like my other diagonals are 4, 3, 0. That, I promise that's a 0, and then negative 6, 5, 2. And then our last diagonal, 8, negative 2, 1. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to work this out where I have a minus sign in between. So like this is 2 times 3 times 8 will be 48. 1 times 5 times 4 would be 20. And then 0 times anything gives us 0. That's our first part. I'm subtracting from that. 4 times 3 times 0 is 0. Negative 6 times, that's a 5, not a 9 times 2 is negative 60, and 8 times negative 2 times 1 is negative 16. So 48 and 20 gives us 68 minus negative 60 and negative 16 gives us negative 76. So I'm subtracting a negative 76, which gives me 68 plus 76, which gives me 144. Okay, and um, there's a way we can do this on the calculator um, that for three by matrices, since we're going to end up having to do a lot of determinants on them, then we'll look at how to do that on the calculator um, in, in another video.